in the supermarkets now. And you still have men who say, oh, bad man, I'm to use a man, I can't give an argument to man. I ask man to buy a pound and that. Disrespectful. Yeah. So the fact that these things are still being said means that we definitely need to build more awareness around menstruation because, come on, it's a part of life. It's a part of life. Mm -hmm. Dennis, it's yeah. all about the growth for me. Yeah. Where sunrise I come from. Yeah. yeah. Look here, you see when you see people are striving in life, no grudge them, you know. No grudge them. Yeah, take time and grow. Take time and Work, grow. Keep working. Press along, Don't saints. Stop. Press, Press along. along. Now, that was back in 2016, October 24 to be exact. Shelly and Weeks graced the sunrise set back then as she set off on her mission to raise period awareness. Seven years later, she is here today and the mission remains the same. However, the impact that she has made has been immeasurable. Yeah. Shelly and Weeks. A resplendent morning to you, my darling. Oh gosh, I think so good. Yeah. You know, I thank you. It looks like somebody sent a green memo, and we all got yeah. it. Yeah, you know, yeah. I, I like it. It looks good. It's a good for me. Yes, <laughs> you know, the green light. Yes, I like. Of that. course, we right. like it. Shelly, I'm so proud of you. Oh. Thank you so, so much. So proud of you. Yeah. And Dennis made a comment earlier with which I agree that when you believe in a year thing, you know, yeah. Cause Shelly has been on many of my yeah. shows, right? Yeah, yes, man. So and many, you yeah. have definitely been a force to be reckoned with. Oh. And I want to congratulate you on your effort and taking on a mantle that wasn't popular or sexy at the time. Yeah. Yeah. Ending period yeah. poverty. Ending and period poverty. This whole campaign going into the schools. I remember. Yes, yeah. well, you know, I'm so happy and thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You have been a part of the journey mm -hmm. i mean we have had many discussions yeah. about uh, periods and the truth is even after seven years of doing this work a lot of the challenges that i had on day one are still very prevalent mm -hmm. we have a culture that celebrates shame when it comes to our bodies yes. and we really really have to make sure that we talk about that and do something about it because we are raising insecure girls who become insecure women yes. and we're raising boys who don't have any respect for girls yes. and then they become men and that is what we see going on in our society so we really do have to change the way we see the way we talk about periods and just the way we relate to each other overall about reproductive health mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so talk to us about the impact that the movement has had for these seven years and how has it grown oh well you know i'm, I'm sitting here feeling so so happy because seven years of seven million products later nice I've, I've donated seven million products so far plus i don't have the exact mm -hmm. figure mm -hmm. i know and we've gone to over 300 schools and we've taught uh over 400 period sessions this week i'm going to 15 schools i went to two yesterday and what is very very um obvious is that it is necessary mm -hmm. we are speaking to teachers who are saying that in the classroom girls are getting up out of their seats messy mm. and they just don't have the products they don't have the tools they don't even have the knowledge and to oh, that wow. where's my camera this is my camera <laughs> parents talk to your children about periods yes. do not wait until their periods start mm -hmm. to start having the conversations because i'm hearing from little girls that a lot of their first time was at school on the way to school or somewhere mm -hmm. where their parents are not and mm -hmm. when it happens to them they don't know what is happening they don't have anything they don't know what to do mm -hmm. and the entire experience end up being a traumatic, traumatic one yeah. mm -hmm. because they were simply not unprepared prepared. So, so actually, and, and Dennis, people will say, but it's 2023, Shelley, really? Everywhere you look, you see sanitary napkins, you see pads being advertised. Who doesn't know about period and who doesn't know about pads? Well... One question I'm if you ask is, who can afford it? Have you Aye. seen the prices of menstrual products lately? Oh, wow. In the last three years, the price of menstrual products has at least doubled, just from the numbers that I have seen. And people forget that this is a reoccurring experience. Yes, every month. And some people, mm -hmm. finances stay away, you know, that one little shift. And the entire thing mashed down, you know. Mm -hmm. And you don't have to be somebody who's completely poor, unemployed. That's when I talk about period poverty. People say, no, man, but tell you, them people, they need to just get themselves together and pull up themselves, man. They must can do this. And I'm saying, how many times have you gone through your day and some unexpected? unexpected expense comes up. Mm -hmm. Your car tire, these potholes are getting very, very purposeful mm -hmm. now. The mm -hmm. There you go. Mm -hmm. And you just drop in the tire, man, and now you have to go buy a car tire. Fully throwing off your expenses for the month because your budget is very... Yeah. Earlier really, that I was very impressed with was, you know, f getting people on board, building a sense of community, you, influencers coming on board and sharing their platforms, and getting people 
uh, companies to donate. How has that been going and how much more do you need? Mm -hmm. Well, can I tell you, I'm very, very happy right now with what is happening, what mm -hmm. it started out at no. Everybody said no. But as I say, I mean, I'm determined. Persistent. So sometimes, sometimes I force them. Yeah. I'm sitting down and say, look here, this could happen to you. Mm -hmm. And that is a fact. You can be going about your day and you're just simply unprepared that day and bloops, your period comes and now you realize that, oh my gosh, so this is what it feels like. You have your money, but you don't have the menstrual products. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you still have to deal with the turmoil and the shame of all of that you have to find about you somewhere and catch up like or something mm -hmm. so yes. you can get to go somewhere and purchase it put yourself in the shoe of the person who not have the money for buying nothing mm -hmm. yes. then just have to catch up something mm -hmm. permanently right. yes. and we're asking little girls to do that mm -hmm. little girls yes. are making that kind of decision every day so when i sit people down and i talk to them same way one-on-one -on -one, that is how i've been able to do it just talk to people one-on-one -on -one and break it down to them sometimes i just tired them tired of me i say all right shelly don't know yeah all right, <laughs> but what they just works, yield <laughs> they yield yeah. to my, my yes. 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 <laughs> no, I, I mean, I've taught girls yes. all my teaching career. Um, and so it, I would imagine it would be easy yeah. for you to go into a girl's school and have this conversation. Yeah. But what about going into like a boy's school? I've done it. Mm -hmm. I went to St. George's College last year. I did an entire period session in college last year. I can't forget it. This one student said, no, miss, I'm going to go with that, miss. I'm going to you know. Mm -hmm. I said, give me five minutes. He ended up staying the entire session. Wow. And sometime in the session, I hear him say, Jano, miss, me never know. Mm. Mm. And it is so important to include boys in the conversation. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Teachers tell me that the relationships between the boys and the girls change yes. when the boys realize that they have a supportive role to play. They shouldn't tease the girls. They should make sure that they're okay. Mm -hmm. If they see they have a mess on the back of the skirt, they only have to go over there and tell them discreetly. It's like an opportunity for them to call down crowd and, laugh, yeah. and laugh and giggle. And once you explain to them, they will understand. I don't know why people feel like children, don't understand. So they will you, understand. So talk to us now because I know that many of our viewers mm -hmm. want to be a part of it. Maybe they're hearing about her flow for the very first time. Yes. How can we be a part of the change? Because I th I say, if you're not a part of the solution, yeah, you're right. part of the problem. Amen. And we want to help our children to worry about one less thing. Correct. You know, and pay more attention to their growth and development and their schoolwork. Correct. I'm going to tell you that, but I brought gifts. I brought period kits. Oh, you did? Yes. Oh, wow. Thank oh, you. Gifts, oh, you're lovely. Ready? You're getting a period oh, kit. No problem. All right. All right. So. <laughs> Look at that. Spicy. There's chocolate in the kit. Don't make sure so you get it. <laughs> oh, nice. If you don't see chocolate, is important. that means he ate it. Oh, wow. I'm telling you that. Chocolate oh, is important. You. Right. So to tell you how you can participate, visit our website. Yes, man. I visit. see Nature Valley, ginger tea. Yes, you need yes, ginger tea. Pure, let me tell you. Yes, you man, you need ginger tea. tea. Oh, oh, you have nice You need wipes. wipes. Mm -hmm. Look at my wipes, brown man. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we definitely See? need that. Look at your little, your little peanut Aww. pouch. Aww. Yeah. <laughs> oh, guys. <laughs> Yeah, we have no man, this nice. Yes, oh, nice, God. Bad. And by the way, during that time of the month, you, you know, your hormonal changes, so you sweat more. So we have our dove. Oh, my God. This is brilliant. And we have so... Shelly. Sometimes you go in the bathroom and they have no soap, Miss Kitty. You know True. how the things stay. True. And you want to make sure that your hands are clean. Make sure your hands are clean oh. when you're handling your menstrual products. Oh. And you get your cup to drink. I mean, ginger tea. Oh, you my can't God. say you're not prepared. So, Shelly, is this, is this what you, you hand out? No, well, it's not so fancy normally, yes. but yes, they normally get oh, a period no. kit, which means what we encourage girls to do is to walk with a period kit anyway, yes. because whether you're on your period or not, you just might be there to help yes. somebody out. I, I call always it the period have. sisterhood. Yes, I yes, always man. have. I always yes, have. Yes, man. So mm. support the period sisterhood. Make sure you always walk with products, and I encourage men to walk with products too, yes. because a lot of have women in our life. So how can we donate, Shelly? Because I want to donate. I yes. want to be a part of it. I mean, over the years, I've always supported you, yes, you have. supported the drive. Yes. Yes, you have. Oh, we need to ramp it up now yes, because there are more little girls who need help and more boys who need information. Correct. So how can we get the products to their hands? Right now you can go to my website embraceherflow.com I have everything that you need to do there if you want to donate. And also, you can get directly in touch with me from there. And we're very, very active on social media as well. Herflow, H-E-R-F-L-O-W, one word. And right now, really, really special, I'm doing a survey just to, make, to get a closer look at, as to what period looks like in Jamaica. So when you go on the website, click the survey, answer the questions, that information is going to be very important. Because when you talk to funders, they want to know the data. And we have not done any, so any real data in, um, nationally yes. around reproductive health periods, anything like that. So that's what I'm trying to do. I, I can't do it fully in, um, nationally because, of course, you know, everybody's not online. But this will give us a glimpse of what it looks like and an argument for me to justify to the funders why I need the money. To do the to help, to, to help with the and things. How much? Well, guys, right. let us support Shelly, her flow, period. Period. We're supporting. <laughs>
period, okay, <laughs> period. So I want each and every one of you, you know, daughters, mothers, aunts, brothers, uncles, every Jamaican support her flow and uh, let us all get together, period, okay? All Thank right. you, Shelly. Wishing you all the best. Thank Continue you so much. And success. Keep up your good work. Yes, yeah, so much. Work. Yay. On the other side of the break, we're...